So I came to video one of the ones on your list. Um, and this is in a nice little neighborhood in McKinney. Um, I want to show you the backyard because I know it is important to you. Um, it's pretty good space, but you can see the fence is in disrepair in some spots. You are on the corner lot, which gives you wider space here. And then you can kind of see out to the street there. Just down the street this way is an open park. So I can take a picture of that before I leave the community. Um, but the backyard's nice and flat. It's just the fence has some problems. Um, and this is a little patio area. It's not covered, but there is a little patio there. I'm gonna show you the inside. Here we are inside. I'm just gonna start at the front and kind of walk you through it real quick. You can tell that the people that are currently here are in the process of moving out. So a lot of things are in boxes or disassembled. And um, so this is your entryway and it looks straight to the family room in the back. Um, there's a little kind of art niche here, a little space above it. Um, that is a coat closet right here, I believe. I haven't opened it yet. Yep, little coat closet. Um, this over here would be, I guess, a dining room or you could use it as an office space. There's no doors closing it, but you could use that for, I don't know, an additional TV room, an office space, um, or a dining room, whatever you choose. So that's right there to the right. You continue through. There is carpet, so at first you have tile at the entry and a small little tile bit, and then it goes to carpet. The carpet is not in terrible shape, but as with most carpet, it's not in great shape either because carpet is just notoriously difficult to keep clean. Um, then you come here and you're on like a laminate hardwood product, um, which is kind of like a brownish reddish tone that does match the cabinets fairly well. Um, you have an island here that overlooks to your family room. You can see this is just a um, like a sheet vinyl flooring, so not real tile, but super easy to keep clean. And again, it's just a just a rental. So you've got dishwasher and then ga gas cooking with the microwave above. I do not believe it comes with a, um, a uh, refrigerator. They usually do not. So I do not believe that is included. And then that is the pantry space there, which is a pretty good size pantry. The cabinets are nice and tall, so that's nice. There's a couple of cats in this house. Um, there's a window seat here. Now this would be just the breakfast nook, but it's a huge room here because all of this ends up being like one big open space, right? So I would probably use this space here for your dining table. Um, and then maybe use the other one as an office space. But this is the family room here. Oh, I scared the kitty. Um, and then we go this way. There's some built-in shelving over here. And then this is the master bedroom here in the back. So it goes from the laminate wood flooring to carpet. And again, it's, it's hard when a home doesn't has just stuff all over the place, but they're in the process of moving, right? So you don't see a bed to take up the room, um, but it's a good size room and nice tall ceilings. And then this is the master bathroom back here. And again, you've got the sheet vinyl. So this is not tile, there's no grout line, just a sheet vinyl. Got a large tub, separate shower. You've got double sinks over here. And this is the master closet. bad master closet it's not huge but if you had a second row you could put more stuff up there but not bad and then I'll go show you the two secondary bedrooms there's a window in here which is kind of nice oh I should close that door it asked me to close all the doors I think because of the kitties okay so coming back through let me go show you the secondary bedrooms We make a right here down the hall, right? And then this is the main bathroom in the house. It's got a single sink, toilet, and a tub shower combination. So this is the bathroom that all guests would use as well as the bathroom for these two bedrooms. And then immediately to the left here is your laundry room. So a washer dryer would go there and that connects to the garage, two car garage. And then here are the two secondary bedrooms. So you continue down the hall and again, there's just stuff everywhere, but it's hard to tell. But this is one secondary bedroom. It does have a ceiling fan. And this is the 
other secondary bedroom. This one, at least there's a bed in here, so it can kind of give you an idea on the size of the room. Um, and also a ceiling fan in this one too. All right, I'll do a little video at the front of the house so you can kind of see what the front looks like. Okay, here we are at the front of the house. It's a very quiet neighborhood. You can hear the birds chirping. Large trees in the front for nice shade, which is nice. Um, it is the corner house, so you only have a neighbor to your left. And if I walk over here, try to show you. And just a short walk down the street right there is where you get to kind of a big open green park space. I don't know if you can see that right there. So the close proximity to that is really nice. So, okay, I hope that helps.